this is today's style. Something that doesn't actually need any hairbands, pins, clips, anything. So it's great for when you're caught out with long hair and you need it up and you've got nothing to do it with. Or your stick's broken or your hairband snapped. Which happens to me on a startling regularity. I will give you a spin to show you what it looks like. Okay, so let's get started. So I have added some curls to my hair. You can do this however you like. I've had to do it with heat because I had already washed my hair today and I had to do it quickly, but you could always wash your hair and leave it in your hairless overnight. You could use your whatever your preferred heat or heatless method is. Okay, so the first part of the actual style I'm going to do is a loose French rope braid, but I'm not going to do the counter twisting on each of the strands. I want it to be very, very loose and flowy. So I will turn around and I will show you how I section the hair and start the rope braid, all right? I've added all of my hair. I'm just going to very gently do the last of the curls. The only tight bit you really need is this very bit of strand here where it's pulling the hair under there just to give it a bit of stability. Now you'll notice that I am twisting away from my head or my face, sorry. Just a tiny bit of counter in the bottom and again all the way down okay so you could just secure this and you would have a loose rope braid you could put a hairband in the end and it would give you just the normal rope braid I'm going to give it a little bit Ooh, of variation across this part Just for a bit of volume. Right, and now I'm going to put the knot in. Now, if you have very, very, very long hair, you could start your knot halfway down. You start prepping for your knot halfway down. But even though my hair goes down to my bum, I need to start it up here to be sure that I catch the knot before the end of the hair. But experiment, experimentation is key with this style. So the way to do the knot is to put a hand just at the top of your braid here. And we're gonna wrap the end around it twice. I go backwards. Make sure you've got some fingers here for grabbing. So over, just let go because the very end doesn't matter. Over, okay, twice over, grab and pull through. Okay, you've got a big knot at the top of your hair, really loose. It's not gonna stay like that. But if you give it a tug down, you'll find that it will eventually do a bit of a, it's quite tough at the top, and then it gets past the bulk of the hair and it forms a lovely knot just at the bottom here with a little bit of a tail. And this actually stays incredibly well. It gives this part of the hair more volume automatically. But if you want a little bit more, you can do a bit of puffing. It's not 
as easy as puffing with a hairband in the end. But I think this gives a lovely voluminous look. Just a little bit more adjustment. So this is my completed style. It is a loose style that's actually very, very secure, but it has quite a lot of flow. If you spin around or move quickly, it will move with you. So it is not necessarily the style for any fast moving activities, not a sport style. It would be fantastic for the beach. It's fantastic for dinner, for going out. I've worn it to go out dancing and it's lasted all night. It's very, very secure. As soon as you've got the double twist before you pull the knot through, this does not go anywhere. You can also give it a little bit of a tug every now and again through the day, just if you want to secure it a little bit, but be careful because if you tighten it too much, it becomes very, very difficult to remove if you are tired or inebriated, as I found at the end of the day that I wore this style. <laughs> so I hope that you have enjoyed this tutorial and if you recreate the style please tag me. I would absolutely love to see how other people do it and style it. I think it would look brilliant with some flowers in it, fresh or fake, depending on how much you like attracting uh, small insects <laughs> to your head. And that is it from me today. Happy styling.